I had to switch bloods because we were down to like 1.2 liters or something. We were basically out of blood. So we have come here in the hopes of finding uh, some materials, namely rave dust. That's really what we're looking for here. Hi guys, how you doing? I don't think I've tried checking. Can you interact with that? No. Okay, you guys are going to be a problem. I'm going to die if I don't move, so let's, let's go ahead and move. Oh, it's Gore Swine. I knew there was a, a good chance of running into him again. And I didn't really want to do that, but here we are. Kaboom! Well, a couple of those guys died. Literally over here just because I'm trying to find some uh, grave dust. Okay, I need to jump down because we are getting absolutely wrecked up there. And I think maybe there was some grave dust. Nope, crude mist stone. Not what I was looking for. Here, let me, let me hide a little bit here. Just to see if we can recover some health. That did not go very well. Yep, this guy's shooting at the thing here. Hi, how you doing? What's your blood? Oh, I missed. Oh, well, whatever. It's fine. Your blood is dead. That's what it is. Okay, close enough to full health. Let's go back up there because we didn't get a single, single bit of grave dust. That's not obnoxious at all. And let's go ahead and switch to animal form. That'll make it a little easier to dodge everyone along the way here. Kachunk. I don't know if we need to be killing. Because I don't remember. Do we need to kill all these dudes? I just... Uh, that's the problem. Kaboom! That does good damage. I want more grave dust so we can make it do even more damage. Because that seems like that'd be a good idea. Here, let's make a point of trashing all of these containers as we walk by in the hopes that they bark out some materials. Or not. Nope, I tried to get away in time. I was too slow on the teleport there. Bones. Bones. Hard to hit the F key when you're already using your finger that would normally be over there to be moving strafing to the right. Doesn't work out very well. Kaboom! Yeah, this is not working at all. Let me just go this way. Jump down. I don't think they'll follow down over here, but maybe they will. How in the world did I get grave dust there last time? Like, honestly. I don't remember. We're super low on blood. I was about to say we might need to just drink that, whatever that is, but, uh... Someone got a little too handsy there and destroyed that guy. Bones, yeah. Tons of bones. We got tons of bones. Tons of bones. I don't know, did we get... Here, can I... Oh, I totally missed. Here, I can do that too. Except mine doesn't keep barfing out... stuff. That's not fair. Free lumber, I'll take that. Here. I don't really want to fight you again, but... Yeah, you you just have too much health. You're not even worth bothering with. Like, do I need to kill these guys to get bones? I don't honestly remember. I know that if I kill them, they stop summoning and their summons go away. Okay. So yes, the answer to that question is I need to kill these guys. Because they're the ones that are going to drop grave dust, apparently. Okay, I'm waiting a second. There we go. There we go, there's some more grave dust. That's perfect, that's what we're looking for. I thought we had found some just, like, lying around before, but apparently not. Oh, wow, that got a crit on one of those guys. 
Yeah, you got hit hard, buddy. I was hoping to freeze you before you summoned anyone. Maybe I did and that was the other guy that summoned? I'm not sure. I want to take that stuff. Here, if I cannot die, I can last long enough to get over there. Interact, take all, and then move. Oh, I'm out of blood. That's going to be a problem. All right. I'm going to die because we're out of blood. Shift! Jump down! That one. Uh, anyone? Anything at all? Died. I was pretty sure I was pushing things by using that... By using so much blood, rather, I should say. And, uh, yeah. I mean, I, I kind of intentionally wanted a weapon that wasn't going to do a ton of damage because I knew we needed to... if they use this blood to do that. I knew we needed blood to be able... Or we needed to be able to feed off of the wolf. But I think I just didn't have enough health to be able to fight, too. So it was kind of just a bad combination there. It looks like I still have all of my equipment on the top bar there, maybe. But I have dropped everything else. So here, let's go ahead and do this. That'll give us a slightly better blood than the frail stuff we have. That was my first death, by the way, so I had not yet died in this game. I wasn't quite sure how death worked, what you drop, what you don't drop, etc., etc. How you doing? Okay, let's go and get rid of you guys. Yoink and yoink and yoink and yoink, and then it looks like we have a bloody bag over here. Just take all of that. So some of the things we still did drop. The salves, the ointments, whatever, the bruise. Those things we did drop, but the rest of it we did not, so... That's... Moderately interesting, I guess. Well, let's go back to the base. And then we can do a little more... Crafting, I think, which should help... Sort of... Get us closer to the point of... Being able to deal with bigger things. Since we have a few hearts, I figured, eh, let's go ahead and put them in. We'll just let them crank away on some greater blood essences. I kind of think what I might want to do right now is go just harvest a bunch of paper, which, uh, honestly sounds kind of terrible, but I just kind of think we can use a little more research at this point. I think that would be a good thing. So we're going to need eight grave dust and four crude sapphires there, so let's take... Oh, you're not over here. I moved. Ha <laughs> ha. Ha ha. I forgot I moved all these things. So here, let's take some grave dust. We don't need all of them. Some sapphires. We do need all of them. And a greater blood essence. And we should be able to come over here and craft... Frozen Eye. And I'll go put away our extra materials. Since we no longer need to be carrying those. I suppose I should probably check. I think these guys are doing pretty good. 210 bones. I don't know about this one over here. This one is kind of a toss-up per time. 160. Yeah, it's fine. I should tell you, in case you didn't notice, when the sun comes in during the day, it does come in right here. So if we were standing right in front of Mr. Devourer, then it wouldn't work. The wall wouldn't work, rather, to block the sun. It just... Depending on the time of day, of course. All that, you know, all that changes things. So this is going to give us a pretty good upgrade in terms of our spell power. So there we go. We've gone up to level 39 when we're using these high-quality axes. Harry can go ahead and have that ring there now. Look at that. Harry's up to a level 21. That's not too shabby for us, I guess. But as I said, we're kind of... I think we're in a spot where... I think we just need more paper and we need... We need more research because... I kind of feel like, uh, I don't know, I mean... Maybe with that upgrade, it's not that big a deal to go... Back out to the Waygate and run around this area, but... I don't know, I mean... 
Interesting. The people of Dunley Singh dance and sacrifice to their savior, the ever burning light. A sacrificial site, huh? I mean, we haven't really wandered around the farm area just yet, so I don't know. I don't know. Do we have any new things here? None of these look new to me. We killed a dude uh, a few ago. After Shock Veil and Chaos. Maybe it was the Chaos Folly? I don't think that's new though either. So. I don't think any of this stuff is actually new. I don't know. The game seems to want me to believe it is, but. I'm not sure. Oh, that's how that works. I was wondering what the P button was for. I was looking at that going, I have no idea what that is. Okay. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go harvest a little bit of uh, stuff right quick and I'll be right back with you. One of the things I've been not doing and probably should be doing is uh, repairing things. So, oh crap, I need copper ingots for those too. All right. I thought I had all the things I needed, but apparently I don't. So whichever box you're hiding in, come with me because I would like to get all these things repaired so that the game will stop telling me to repair them. And uh, yeah, better. So to our research desk, we go with exactly 50 paper and we have unlocked the upgraded vest. <laughs> That's actually really good because um, I was literally just thinking we need to upgrade that one. It's not going to be a huge difference, but it will be a difference just the same. So we'll go ahead and do that and then put you on and that should give us level 41. Excellent. I mean, I still think that stuff is somewhat arbitrary and I don't really know how to make hide nor head nor tail nor whatever out of it so i'm still a little kind of like i don't know whatever i mean it it gives me a number and it says i do damage and it's really just a matter of how quickly do things die do they die quickly enough or do they not and if they don't what can i do to make them die quicker quicklier there you go that's the word i was looking for quicklier obviously let's make a few more vermin salves i need some more bones just queue up a few of those guys. And we can throw all these guys back in there. That's fine. Uh, I guess we need more room for that then. Did I not have one I could stack that into? Did not! Oh, because I put the rats in there. Whatever. Here, take out the rats. Take that. Rats can go in. Hey. Rats can go in there and that's fine. Let's go ahead and teleport, and we'll just uh, do a little more explorationing for today, because I spend most of my day just mindlessly gathering materials, which honestly gets kind of annoying. Back in the farmlands, I am kind of curious to see what this the sacrificial site is. So let's go ahead and head over to that before we do anything else. So oh, what is this? This looks like crystal or something. Ah, quartz. Okay. I hesitate to collect too much of anything because it's just a long, stupid long run to get back. Sacrificial site. Okay. It's not really much here. But it looks like maybe someone... Someone got burned? Someone got burnt to a crisp? Would be my guess? I don't know got a cotton farm and we've got a farm. Horses, huh? Can I ride a horse? And if I can ride a horse, does it run faster than a wolf? I mean, I guess I'm just going to start collecting materials here. I don't know. Cow and a cow. Uh, I kind of wonder. I don't remember creature blood, what it does. Let's go ahead and kill a cow. Hi, right, come back. I'm not done with you. 
Never mind. I'm just drinking the blood of your cow. This is not weird at all. Yeah, I, I kind of wanted the movement speed there. What are you? Uh, you're a villager. Uh, you're a worker. Worker? Interesting. Worker blood. I don't think I've noticed that one before. Hi. Can I feed on your blood? I want to see what worker blood does. I'm curious. This has turned into a research session. Thanks for your hearts. Increased resource yield. Yes, please. Oh, that's delightful. What are we getting? 10 to 30%. So does that mean we are getting 15? Are we getting 10? What are we getting here? Oh, look at all these sunflowers. This is... Oh, you have even better blood. Come back. Yes, I'm a vampire. Hello. How are you? Thank you. Appreciate that. Look at that. Ooh. Much better, I guess. I don't know. Wow. Attack level is too low to harvest sunflowers. Never did I think I would see the day. So how far does this guy's place go? Or these... Uh, these peeps, their place? How far does it go? Can I get apples? I cannot get apples, but I can get reinforced planks. Okay. So I guess what we're going to do is head over to the other farm. Because I didn't see a horse over here. And I'm very curious about this horse thing, because... If I could find one, I would like to interact with it and see what can be done. Um. I kind of hate how they how you control them. Very interesting. Excuse me, coming through. But you can just keep doing this, and you gallop. It seems to be pretty quick, I guess. I don't know. Oh no! I'm going to melt, because sun. Hey! Don't do all these things to my horse. We're, we're best buds. We've, we've grown up together. We spent our lives together. Practically knows what I'm thinking before I even think it. That's... That's how loyal and good this horse is. I have no idea where the crap I'm going. I'm... Can you... Can you jump down? Okay. That's a hard... Hard yes. Perfect. Alright. Let me, um... Ooh, boy. I don't know where I'm going. I guess I'm trying to get back to base? I don't even know. Oh, that's such a run! The thing that's kind of annoying about the horse, aside from controlling it, is that everything wants to kill you when you're on the back of it, because, you know, you look like a vampire, so they all just, you know, want to kill you and stuff. Uh, how do I dismount? Like that. Excellent. Horse, um, I don't know what to do with the horse, but... I, I suppose you should just go ahead and graze on the stone tile and I guess we call it good because we have a horse. Barely. I mean, hard to show you everything that was involved in uh, running around. It was kind of a pain. Oh, look at that. So the horse has... Horses can have different stats and finally a use for those stupid water skins that I haven't known what to do with. Uh, here, let's, let's maybe take two of those. I don't know, I mean, horse. Um, how did I do that now? That guy. There you go. Keep your horse alive by supplying it with water. I mean, I don't know that I want to, but... Uh, horse. I guess we're gonna call you... Eh, Rushmore the Horse. I like the sound of that. That works for me. I think that's where we're gonna leave this one. Catch you another one, Till, and thanks for watching. See you later.